Good morning, my Cancers. Happy Water Sign Day. I'll, I'll be honest with you. This is the fourth uh, attempt at doing this reading. Every time, I'm just, as my right ear is really ringing, I, I've actually mixed the cards up to reshuffle. It is the same energy. It is the same energy. I really feel like somebody's in their heart space. I feel like somebody, it could be because you're dealing with family. You, you just, you have a lot in your mind. You have a lot in your heart and you're on your mind. And I feel like you're, maybe you're trying to be happy for others, but you really need this time for yourself. Ten of Cups reverse and a star reverse. It's, I feel like somebody's afraid. Maybe you're afraid for your loved ones or afraid in a relationship of losing something. But I, I get, honestly, Cancer, um, people don't really know what you're dealing with because you, you're trying to keep this. You don't want other people to have to worry. King of Wands and the Justice card. I feel like th that could be you, King of Cups, King of Wands, and a Justice, but inside you got a Ten of Cups reverse going on. Um, Star reverse, Nine of Wands, and the Four of Wands. Four of Wands is happiness, but Nine of Wands is trying to hold on to something. And Star reverse, maybe you're afraid of losing. You know, it could be a change. There's the Eight of Swords, the worry and the, and the devil. Um, it could be, it could be a change. It could be a happy change. You know, for instance, if you have grown kids and they're ready, well, almost grown kids and they're going to go away or move away, you could really be, you know, you know, this is part of life, but at the same time, it, it, it you know, for some of you with that 10 of cups reverse, it, it just feels a heaviness on one's heart. Let's, let's just get into your reading. The pre-energy is tough. No matter how many times I tried to do this. So general energy for the Cancerians, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Cancer, know a Cancer, feel like being a Cancer. Well, Cancers, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Cancer and this resonates. You could be dealing with a Cancer, it could resonate as the main story, and Cancer could be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Cancer. This reading could be for a Cancer. Take it as it resonates. I feel like you're you're trying, you're, I saw the Strength card, the Seven of Pentacles, and now you're Queen of Pentacles. I feel like you're trying to be strong for other people, or, but you are, dealing with something very emotional and you're trying you just don't I don't even think you want to sh really share it for some of you are keeping it to yourself what's the reason for the reading or not the reason what's the general energy what are the messages for cancer what are the messages for the cancerians the three of wands Aries energy what's influencing the three of wands What's influencing the Three of Wands? The Eight of Wands. That's good, Sagittarius. Oh, look at that. Ace of Pentacles, the Star, the Page of Cups. Seven of Cups reverse. So we got the Three of Wands and the Eight of Wands. So we have Aries and Sagittarius. Three of Wands is waiting for the right time to move on, move forward. It is a card of waiting for a ship to come in, but in this deck, she's already got a ship. She's got a ship in her hand. Um, she's got options. She's got opportunities, but she, honestly, she's not going backwards. So if you're in a relationship right now that you're not very happy in, eight of wands, page of cups, maybe you're talking to someone new, honestly, star, and it's a very hopeful change going on here because now you have an ace of pentacles. Seven of Cups reverse is clear and where you really emotionally want to be at this time, but you're also clear, Knight of Pentacles reverse, where, what you don't want to keep giving to. Eight of Wands and a Three of Wands, I really feel like it's waiting. What's influencing this Three of Wands is a change in the wind, something strong moving in your life. Eight of Wands is, is movement, it's traveling, it's passion, it's happiness. All right, well, that's the reason for the reading. What's the reason for the reading for the Cancerians? What's the reason for the reading for the Cancerians? I, see, I keep seeing in the corner of my eye, the two of cups. I don't look at the cards when I shuffle. I see it go by. What's the re reason for the reading for the Cancerians? The page of wands reverse. All fire. And that could be where... I mean, some of you in that Ten of Cups reverse or the Star reverse, or that was, I don't know if that was this read or one of the readings I, I had to start over. Um, it's like, you know a path, there's a path you want, but it's not, nothing's happening at this time. Okay, what is, and I feel like you can't talk about it. What is in the past? What is in the past? 
for Cancer, what is in the past? The Knight of Pentacles. Something slow, moving, marijuana leafy horse. A new path un unveiled. A Virgo energy. What is on your mind? What is on your mind? The, you. High Priestess Reverse. Cancer, I feel like there's there's something you are, I feel like there's been a secret. There's something you've been keeping to yourself. High Priestess Reverse is no longer keeping something secret. What's in the near future? You don't want to keep the secret anymore. What's in the near future? Some of you have a secret relationship going on. What's in the near future? What's in the near future for the Cancerians? And the Queen of Swords. Getting closer. You're getting closer. Only because if you look at this Three of Wands, which is a Queen of Wands, something's... I feel like something's pulled you into the fire element. Something passionate, something you're excited about. Now look at the Queen of Swords. For once she's on the brink of something, now the Queen of Swords. I f honestly, Cancer, this might be somebody else. It might be somebody else. Let's see. What the heck is going on with your reading? I feel like I'm feeling like there's a secret here. There's something you've been dealing with. You can't share it with other people. Maybe you're in a connection, you know? And it's somebody else. Ace of Swords and the Seven of Swords reverse. Wanting to sneak away from something. Maybe you've been sneaking away to be with this energy. Um, and you're waiting for this energy to come back around. There's there's a secret lovers going on, no doubt about it. Three of Wands influencing the Eight of Wands. And the Page of Pentacles. Honestly, I feel like something's been slowly brewing. You see what I did there, Cancer Brewing? No, I feel like something's been slowly building, something you've been working on, but I feel like it's a secret. They're in something, you're in something, you're both in something. But the High Priestess Reverse, the secret's coming out or you don't have to keep the secret anymore. Page of Pentacles, Eight, eight of Wands. I honestly feel, because pages are small, but I feel like somebody's coming towards you, you're going towards them. It's small, but it's mighty. Nine of Pentacles equal a Ten of Pentacles. I feel like there's a connection here that started off very small, very fun, and somehow it's getting very serious. I think you're okay with that, though. Even though we have a Page of Wands reverse reason for the reading. Why is the Page of Wands reverse reason for the reading? Why is the Page of Wands reverse reason for the reading? Page of Wands and the Ace of Wands and the Sun reverse. Look at the fire. Page of Wands reverse, Ace of Wands and the Sun reverse. Especially in the, you got the Knight of Wands. Page of Wands reverse can feel bored in one's life. So let's just say you're in a relationship now or a marriage now or a job now, if this is a work reading. And you're just bored with it. You're honestly, that could be a page of one's reverse. I I just don't feel connected to this anymore. I don't feel happy doing what I'm doing. And then something with this page of pentacles comes into your life that takes you to new heights. It makes you feel things. It makes you want things. But they want you too. The queen of swords, I feel like this is the problem that needs to be solved here in the near future two parties want each other but the queen of swords is figuring out the logistics of it how do we make this work we both want each other we both want this to work but how do we make this work because i don't i want you with me either in work or in a relationship some of you this might be a work read and the queen of swords is like no the queen of swords is is a problem solver it's clear communication where we'll get there what's the knight of pentacles in the past Something moving slowly, but very cautiously. What's the Knight of Pentacles in the past? Virgo energy. So maybe this has been going on since Virgo season for some of you. What's the Knight of Pentacles in the past? What's the Knight of Pentacles in the past? And the Three of Swords. Libra and energy. Give me another card with that. Three of Swords. I do feel like somebody's very cautious. You got the world, the justice, and the Four of Pentacles reverse. 
I feel like somebody's very cautious. Somebody could be getting out of something, releasing something with the three of swords and, and they met you. Maybe this is what you bonded over. What's the high priestess reverse on your mind? High priestess reverse cancer card on cancer's mind. And the eight of pentacles. Cancer, cancer. I'm smiling. Eight of pentacles is Virgo energy again. We have a progression from the Knight of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles. Somebody's making a strong offer, and you want this with the High Priestess Reverse. You really want this. But that Page of Wands Reverse, I feel like you have to leave something else behind to have this. You have to leave a job. You have to leave a home. You have to leave a relationship to take the Six of Pentacles and Eight of Pentacles. This is an outstanding offer. And you really want it with these wands and the fire. What is the Queen of Swords in the near future, Libra and Energy? What's the Queen of Swords in the near future? What's the Queen of Swords, Libra and Energy in the near future? And the King of Cups reverse Scorpio. Give me another card with that. King of Cups reverse and the Queen of Swords. I feel like this is, some of you, this is what you're leaving behind. King of Cups reverse. And the Eight of Swords. If you are in a current relationship, this is the Page of Wands reverse, the King of Cups reverse, and the Eight of Swords. This is where, this is the problem right here. I feel like it's not a problem you can't get out of. Eight of Swords is, a, a, is what's going on in your own head. It's, it's, I wouldn't say a mental problem, but I don't mean it like that. It's a, it's a problem that probably nobody else knows about. And what it is, is I feel like you're dealing with somebody who could be very, you just don't want to be there anymore. You may not even have love for a current situation anymore. Um, actually, for some of you, give me another card with that Queen of Swords. Some of you, this might be their, like if they're got a connection, this might be their, on their side. Looking into what's what they, I just got that real strong. What's this Queen of Swords here? Magician. I don't think, honestly, I don't think they care. Got the lovers there and the queen of cups. Somebody knows they are unhappy in an old situation and they want this new situation. I am getting a third party looking closely. I don't feel like that. If you're, de let's just say cancer, if you're dealing with somebody that is connected to someone, I feel like this is who they're connected to. But I'll be honest, I don't, whoever you're connected to, if you're still with me, because I know this is confusing, whoever you're connected to, they don't have any more love in the situation for it. I don't even think they care. I think it would be a relief because they, they're tired of sneaking around. They're tired of, of watching their back with this maybe i just feel like they're very unhappy here or cancer this could be you very unhappy here and you're just wanting to be in this new situation so badly that it would be an an easy like kind of like a ripping off a band-aid like that might even be a better situation some of you are just like i don't even care anymore high priestess reverse on your mind tells me you don't even want to hold this back anymore you're not silent anymore. You want this new offer, Six of Pentacles and Eight of Pentacles. You want this new job or new relationship. Where you are, you're just with Page of Wands, reverse, completely bored, silly, tired of living life like this. And Ace of Wands and a Sun reverse. Sun reverse can be a delay in one's happiness until you take this new beginning. And the magician in the near future tells me you're going to take this new ace. You're not going to let this, this opportunity pass you by this whoever this is they want you just as badly and whatever you're leaving behind cancer it's not a very happy situation but i do feel like you this has been something that nobody even knows about you've been dealing with this very it's a very personal matter so even like your best friend may not even know about this or your closest confidant but you have something here that you don't want to let go and they don't want to let you go. And I just feel like, I think, I feel like a lot of you cancers are going towards it. Yeah, that's what I have for you, cancer. Have a fantastic rest of your week and I will see you guys later. Take care.